Good morning. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Alma Senna and I'm a part-time reseller on various sites like Poshmark, eBay, Mercari, and Depop. And today I'm here with a quick haul. I actually had a chance to go sourcing a little bit yesterday, which was Saturday, only for like four hours or so because it was a super busy day, like I explained on my last video. But anyway, hope the, you guys are doing amazing. Hope your sales and thrifting went really well. Um, yeah, today after this, after I film this, I'm going to go out and about. We're actually two days in a row. We're going to get like 65 to 70 degree weather. So I want to be out and about enjoying some of that sunshine because who knows how long it's going to last. So today I have a lot of bread and butter. I think I found a couple of bangers though. So even though I just didn't have that much time to go out and about, I, it was a pretty successful trip. So anyway, let's go ahead and get started. Um, and hopefully the lighting is good. Um, this is the best that I could get. The first one here is going to be for me. I found the wedgie skinny. And I know that um, these are a size 25. I believe these are going to fit me. They're like that gray wash jeans. So anyway, yeah, I'm going to keep these. Um, average cost of goods is about five bucks but these were 350 because it's half off on my stores on the weekend so seven dollars with half off of that then next i recognize this brand um this is definitely a bolo i think it's twisted heart so a quick little story a couple of months ago i found and i had no idea what this brand but was it was a velour tracksuit it was the pants and the shirt, but it was super embellished on the back. It had like big, like ruby hearts and the pants were also embellished. You guys, I got that for seven bucks and I sold it for a hundred full price offer. So today I was, uh, well, yesterday I was looking around for the bottoms, even though the embellishment is not that amazing on this one, I'd still say I can flip this for 30 bucks. It's a size large. Again, that's a twisted heart. So yeah, this is super cute, comfy. So something to look out for. So I can't wait to list that. The next, I'm not sure if it's a fail or not because it's J. Crew. It's like this little velour blazer. Let me try it on. So it's like a salmon color. It's not coming out like a salmon color, but it really is. Um, you know what? It doesn't have a size on it. It's got like this little eye hook closure. So that's the thing. I didn't notice it didn't have a size on this. This I did pay $5 for. I looked everywhere. I think obviously it was cut off. Had I known that it had no size tag, I probably wouldn't have picked it up, but it fits me. So I'm thinking it's like a small, but what I'll do is look up other similar comps, see their measurements, and then go buy those as well. Um, I never pick up a lot of kids clothing, but look at how cute these little Patagonia little pants were. So it has the, these are only $2. It has the, um, tags here and everything. So, I mean, does that make them reversible because it has the logo on both sides, but wouldn't they have to cut these tags off to make it reversible? So I'm not sure, but for $2, the Patagonia little baby pants. So I was super Happy to find those. This is just a sweater for work. No, yes, yeah, it's a sweater because it was still snowing up until like last week here. Use all the noise here. I'm gonna empty out my little bags here. Um, okay, the next was a pretty cool brand. Uh, let me see, Free People. But look at these cute, these were three bucks, but they're like faux leather, faux leather pants. So I don't know what this was gonna sell for, um these were a size 26 hmm. almost my size but i don't need those and i don't think i'd wear those uh marmot is the next brand this is a fleece um this is bread and butter a fleece uh full zip marmot and extra large you guys know what the tag is um this was 250 so five with half off yeah my thrift stores definitely have um great sizing i mean great pricing so okay the next brand i don't pick up but i've heard other resellers say that they do it's Catherine's. and hear me out the reason i picked this out because there it was a full zip and there were three p 
pieces of this Catherine's. Let me see where the next, the last one is. Um, so three pieces of Catherine's clothing. They were two fifty a pop, and they were all the same size. Let me see what size they were. They were a three X, amazing size. So I I know that. I'm sorry, I keep messing with this little uh, microphone. But anyway, um, I've heard other resellers say that they sell it for about 20 to 25 bucks. So I'm thinking lotting them up for $75. What do you guys think? I'm going to save the bangers for last too, by the way. Do you guys pick up Catherine's? Comment below and let me know. If you guys do or not. Oh, here's a receipt. I need to put that away. Okay, last week I showed this brand to you guys, Clio. I, this is a Dublin, Ireland wool, um, pure wool little vest. Look up the comps. They're amazing. These, this is 10 bucks. I found it at the same thrift store as I did last week. Same size. So I, obviously it's the same person that donated this, uh, great quality wool. And with wool, you always want to check to make sure there's no like moth holes or anything like that. And there wasn't. So I am excited to list that. Um, I keep reaching over. Okay. These were Crocs. For three dollars half off and look at the tread looks really good they have um their fur i say fur line or something like that so i'll lint roll the inside as best that i can but crocs is always a great little bread and butter brand of course this is also for me for work just a little shirt oh the next are two patagonias i mean nothing nothing substantial or anything like that i found these back to back uh they were six dollars each half off so this is um i think i'm going to lot them up together they're the same exact size which i think was six women six so i'm going to lot these babies up and again when you find multiples of the same thing it's more enticing for buyers for you to lot them up so absolutely okay Soft surroundings, I always say I'm not going to pick it up, but I do. This is a petite, small, super long maxi dress. I heard the maxi dresses sell. I have so much soft surroundings. I still need to list from my money pile. I have been listing more and more, but I just need to sit down and go through all of my dresses and get those listed. The next, what are you here? Oh, I've sold this brand before. It's a cinch. Where is it? It's cinch. Well, this will probably show better inside. Why can't I find it? Cinch up. These jeans are a, they're five bucks half off. They were a 44 34 I just sold some for 30 bucks like last week, but they did have a little distressing on the bottom, but that's okay. It's a great size. I'll list them for 25 bucks. I know that those will sell really well. Um, oh, the next is for me. It's a J. Crew Too Petite Long Maxi Dress. It's silk. It's like a salmon color. I don't know how to show this because the lighting is so bright. It's kind of washing it out. But yeah, I'm going to go on a trip, hopefully the end of May. Tropical little vacation. So I figured that this would be a nice little silk dress. And if I don't want it afterwards, I can sell it. And just with the material content alone, I don't pick up a ton of J. Crew, But um, I figure that with that a material content it's going to up the value these are just some good old-fashioned levi's men size 36 uh three bucks half off a dollar 50 20 to 25 bucks easy you can get those the next brand sorry i feel like i'm rushing because i have to meet my friend for breakfast soon oh brooks brothers you guys know this is a a um, super expensive, re it sells a lot for retail. It's an extra large vest. It was new with tags. Again, I got it for four bucks, half off. It's a men's vest. Men's vest over here. Sorry again, the lighting. So I wasn't gonna leave that behind. I figured 25 to 30 bucks. The next is a cool piece for vintage. Uh, I think it's vintage because look at this. This was only five bucks, half off. Vintage tag, but look at this color block pullover windbreaker i think this is gonna do phenomenal on depop i want to say but look at that i didn't see any stains that's a super fun print on the back right there but yeah that was a great little find there 
uh, getting to the bottom i look in the kit section and i've talked to you guys before uh, again about obermeyer is a great ski brand these were four bucks half off little kids uh yeah i picked up a couple of kids uh, items size 10 some snow pants but the only thing is when i got home i saw a little tiny tear but it you know what i know um, it's cold somewhere somebody's gonna need this obermeyer retails for a ton these are some snow pants but you know what if i list them for 25 30 bucks i bet you guys they will still sell and move i've sold plenty of obermeyer before down to my last i think four fives oh actually five okay so here we go it's gonna be a lot of patagonia here have you guys seen patagonia size small these almost look like the um uh, what do you call those the hospital pants that the nurses the scrubs that's what i'm trying to say have you guys seen these before in patagonia um what is the material content on these guys they are elastane and polyester again they feel like exactly like those scrubs so does patagonia make scrubs i have no idea but yeah i found those speaking of scrubs look what i found figs new with tags and they only wanted two bucks guys two bucks at half off so a dollar isn't that cool i've, I've found uh, figs many times these are a xxl i found them plenty of times but i don't think that new with tags so figs is a bolo for sure they always move great hospital nursing brand um very very popular last three items what do i have here oh actually this is not really a bolo but i picked it up it was four off and it was champion new with tag just some men's pants like polyester pants with a draw string here and again you can't beat it a little like super light perfect for like the outdoors hiking etc you can't beat that now my last two finds are my favorite i said a lot of patagonia here you go patagonia men's small puffer jacket hooded i think this is down i don't remember if it was down or not yep down so i am can't wait to list this one super excited and then the last i did pay up 10 bucks rock revival look at that bling on the pocket this is a women's size 34 boot cut boot cut is in so amazing finds so again for being in a hurry yesterday again my sourcing time i didn't have much and today everything is obviously closed on sunday most of the thrift stores are going to be closed today of course because of the holiday weekend but anyway so i hope you guys have an amazing day i love to hear what your favorite piece of mine that i found was below um like and subscribe share the video i try to make two to three of these videos a week for you guys um and thank you again for my new subscribers almost approaching 100 in my existing i do appreciate all your support and we'll talk to you soon bye